one of the differentiators for PSYOP is how active the members are in society. A lot of professional societies are fairly passive, but at PSYOP, the vast majority of members are very involved, they're very engaged. I was on a committee my first year out of grad school, and from then on, I've been on committees every year since. Being on a committee is really exciting. You get to connect with a lot of different people, um, and regularly. Particularly when you're just starting out, I can remember for me personally, when I graduated from the University of Tennessee, I think it was um, when the dinosaurs were roaming on, on the planet. At any rate, I volunteered for the awards committee, and then the workshop committee, and then the programs committee. It doesn't matter, there are lots of committees, but instantly you're going to know 10 to 15 people. Volunteering allows me to, number one, to continue to network and build relationships, meet new people, expand uh, the relationships I already have. Number two, it gives me an opportunity to stay on the cutting edge of the science and practice of our field. If you're able to and have the time to serve on a committee, I would really encourage you to do so. When I think about volunteering with SIOP, there are a lot of formal ways. Running for office is a very formal way. Um, but then there's also being appointed as a committee chair, being a, a member of a committee. Those are also formal governance um, volunteer activities. But in addition, we have a lot of task forces, things like that, where it's maybe a one-time uh, injection of your expertise. I'm volunteering at the Leading Edge Consortium. Volunteering is a great way to be in the mix, um, if, especially if you're an introvert like me. It gives you a reason to be in the room, uh, which can be great. It can get you in the room. And, um, and just an opportunity to meet people. What prompts me to contribute by reviewing submissions for PSYOP is, first of all, it's obvious that there's a need. PSYOP has grown so much that I can only imagine the, the blizzard of submissions that come in, and I know that people need to look at that and, and review it. Otherwise, there isn't gonna be a PSYOP, it has to be done. So I feel like the least I can do is, is read a few of these things and you know offer my opinion. The more connections and chance you have to build a, a network of individuals who can be supportive to your career, the better. So the, by volunteering, you get to know other people in the field. By signing up and saying, hey, I want to be part of that committee, or I'd be happy to help organize this or help organize that, I think you gain a lot from it. But there's also a sense of uh a sense of pride or value, I guess, in terms of being able to help the profession, help the organization become even better, even bigger, uh, and, and really service other members. You will learn, you will grow, you will meet friends and colleagues, and you will be excited to be a part of ISML.